Y'all thought that I was faded, yo, I'm still standing tall. But if he's standing in the sky, the one and only one. And now I took the boot to get my fruit. So I should not fear anybody made of blood. Yo, I got my own problems to deal with. Straight up good, like top of this mountain here. Right in front of me, to the greatest MC that ever could be. Now look into the horizon as far as the eye can see. Now that's really me. Oh, oh snap on Wednesday, bitches. Oh. How's it going, Tyler? Doing fabulous. Good, good. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, fans of all ages. <laughs> oh, man. So, yeah, so there's all the new colors for those. Oh, look at that. You got orange, colors. too. Man. Yeah, we've got the traditional green, orange, and red. Yeah. Now add to that the, the mm. gunmetal gray and the high base yellow and the blue. Yeah. So trade in any piece of shit. Any piece of shit. Does it have to be side cutters or to get nope. like any and really? anything? And you get thirty bucks off. Yeah, it's not bad. It's a good deal. <clears throat> of course, the promo for this week in the hot tools flyers, the dead blow hammers, and the air hammers. Mm -hmm. And then again from the trade show, all the old, the old handle handles, the hard handles, but now you get. A variety of colors. Oh, look at that, eh? So you're starting to get some of the new stuff rolled in. New old. New old, yeah. So, yeah. yes. That's awesome. And then this is kind of some of the first stuff I got from the trade show. I got the vernier calipers, um, the butane soldering iron, the water nozzles, the torches. Yeah. It's all starting to show up now. <laughs> you put in a huge order, did you? I did so. Yeah. In my garage right now showed up yesterday three floor jacks, three roll carts, and two welders. Oh, really? My wow. garage filled up in a hurry. <laughs> they need a storage unit. It all shows up at one time? You get like one truck that shows up? or? No, the product that I ordered there will show up over the course of the year. Yeah. Now it's kind of front end loaded, so the first month and a half you get a lot of it. Yeah. But yeah, one truck delivered it all. Wow. That's awesome. <clears throat> so, what do you do with all those uh, boxes that you, or those carts that you had last week? Those go in your in your storage, or? Uh, well, no, those weren't mine. Oh. Those belong to the branch. Okay. So that regional manager that was with me. Gotcha. He brought all those in to run a promotion for the whole group. Okay. I see. He just didn't have many left for the next guy. <laughs> Did you sell a bunch? And, well, he only got <laughs> they had one floor jack left. Oh yeah. One of floor jacks. I sold the rest of them. Yeah. So the next guy gets kind of. Yeah. Has to wait. And oh. there's a. Got a oh, good yeah. picture with the the lights. Oh, yeah. Underneath the worktop for the epic. That's really cool. So it's just the epic, obviously, right? Because yes. all the other tops sit flush with the. That's correct. Yeah. Yeah. That's awesome. Now, it, I mean, it may <clears throat> come out for the. Master Series, yeah, because you do have that. Yeah. Oh yeah, you, yeah. You got the right there. But I, I don't know. Yeah, makes sense. I was told at this time no, but we shall see. Well, once you add it to one thing, then everyone else wants it too, so it becomes a demand, right? Oh. Yeah, it'll, it'll just never show up, I don't think, for the classic because you. It's flush. The worktop would be over, really, yeah. sticking out too far. And, yeah, makes sense. But, yeah. Awesome. How much are the uh and the tunnel legs? Oh. And all assorted colors. Yes, they're annoying. I bang my head off <laughs> twenty times a day. But so do all my clients and that's the idea. Yeah. Well, you gotta be yeah, six. You, you six go bonk and you yeah. go, What the hell's with this? Oh, they're on sale. <laughs> um some people may not know. The standard light is a very pure white LED. Yeah. Um, 
this is the same model of light, but it's a, they call it a true TRU, and it's a different bulb. See, it's kind of a more of a yellowish light. Yeah, I see that. Oh, I, don't, I can't see it on the, oh, well, maybe you can. Come on, if you, just if you look at the roof, white and yellow. Yeah, I can see that. Um, the pure white LED tends to wash out colors on in wiring, mm -hmm. so it's hard to tell the difference in the color. Okay. The this LED <clears throat> enhances <clears throat> colors, mm. so it makes it easier to see. Interesting. Learn something new every day. Oh, that's the boss. Oh. Oh, oh. The wife. Yeah. <laughs> the boss. <sighs> yeah. She can hold for a minute. Until she sees this video. And then she'll know I ignored her and I'll yeah. be in trouble. <laughs> thanks a lot, Joel. Yeah, exactly. Getting me in trouble. <laughs> well, you got a new guy starting in the shop next week? Yeah, a new guy. I know him. So I'm bringing him over. So that'll be uh, pretty cool. I worked with him over at uh, over at one of my last places. So, well, not with him. He worked at the building over, part of the same group. So known him for a while. So... We'll uh, replace the one guy that we let go, and uh, yeah, so it'll be good. Look right forward. on. And he's he's full Hyundai trained, so it'll look look forward to having somebody that's got like more experience than any of us in the shop. So that'll be good. So less comebacks and less annoyed customers, and more more fixed vehicles. So mm -hmm. knowledge it in works a different point us. of view is always a good thing. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Absolutely. <clears throat> yep. Yep. And you will see sometime in the near future one of these. Oh yeah. I saw those at the at the trade show on the trade show pictures. You're gonna have one of them on the truck. I'm gonna try to. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> How big is it? Just like complete life size? Yes. It's not like one of the mini ones that you get at Canadian or uh, not Canadian Tour. No. Walmart. No. That's awesome. That's cool. I look forward to that. So someone's gonna win one. Yes. That's great. So the promo I have going on right now is for the Apollos and the Tritons. Um, our new intelligent diagnostics. <laughs> See? Oh yeah, they're on sale. <laughs> you, you buy one of those and yeah. you go in the draw, you get a one in ten chance to That's get the arcade game. Cool. So you gotta sell ten of those first before you Yes. Yeah. Awesome. Cool. But it'll be worth the wait. Yeah. Yeah. They're, how many games are on that thing? Just the one? No, so, there's like 82 it, games or something really? on there. So it's all the old, the old Pac school. Pac-Man, Asteroids, Galaga, That's all that super stuff. super cool. Good for a man cave. So a lot of those games predate on some of my customers. Yeah. Most of them. Yeah, some of them me, for sure. They're going to turn it on and look for Call of Duty and... <laughs> that new one they go online and they just fight oh uh, Fortnite Fortnite yeah <laughs> Fortnite's not on there Fortnite's not on there no um yeah that's not my jam hmm. Street Fighter you got Street Fighter on there <laughs> it's probably oh, it's probably the best movie. arcade game to ever come out Street Fighter on the old Sega yeah But yeah, yeah, and if I can, and I don't know if the electronics would like it, um, I'd like to plug it in. Yeah. Have it in here, but I don't know. How much juice it takes? Uh, I can supply the power. Yeah. It's the bouncing around I'm oh. not so sure about. Yeah. Put it back here somewhere and let, That's uh, my thought. We'll let see. your customers uh, play around a little bit. If I can make it happen, I will. Well, they think about buying a new a new Triton or Apollo. <laughs> <clears throat> Yeah, if you want to play a game, you have to take one for a test drive. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. Or at, cool. at least sit through my sales pitch on it. <laughs> <laughs> Selling timeshares. Come on up. Come on this on the truck. Last night. Oh, yeah. It's basically a training seminar for our intelligent yeah. diagnostics. I always wondered, is that free for, for all the clients? Yes. They just, you guys have got a place set up and then they yep. they go and cool. Um, in fact, 
Like if you wanted training on any of our items, yeah. uh, you go to the diagnostics website, um, www.diagnostics.snapon.com yeah. and it will have an image of all of our diagnostic platforms yeah. and you select the one you want training on and then there will be anywhere from 4 to 12 modules oh. in there I think it, maybe I have seen that so like uh, for a, a, a Modus, Triton, Varus, Zeus there will be a lot more because there's training on the lab scope portion right? or you can go for the Solus, the hmm. Apollo, the Ethos, they're all on there. And that's cool. free of charge to anybody who wants to do it. That's awesome. Available that's good 24 7. A lot of people probably don't even know that, so that's good. No. And, and it's there. It's just they don't advertise it for whatever reason. Yeah. Cool. Well, when when I sell a unit, uh, after doing my introductory training on one, which is more of a knobology, how to move around, how to navigate the menus, yeah. um, I ask everybody to go do those modules yeah. so you get the background. And then after that, we bring in a trainer that can come in-house okay. and answer that's, questions that's that one. and train you on... No, no, but right here. Oh, okay. They will okay. come in and give you the more advanced training. There's no point in having a trainer come in to show you how to press yes or no buttons. Yeah. Right? Yeah. <laughs> so he'll come in after you've learned how to use the unit a little bit um, and played with it for two, three weeks. <laughs> then when he comes in, you will have real-life intelligent questions. That's awesome. Yeah. Get what you pay for. So you get training up front for <laughs> me, training online and then training later from our diagnostic sales that's cool developer. that's awesome yeah satisfaction is guaranteed here at snap on tools there you, there you go all right well i should probably get back in back to work yep all right guys we'll see you in the shop have a great day all right guys welcome back to the shop here on snap on wednesday uh i hope you guys enjoyed that uh that intro that's uh, that's our, our buddy Jermaine. He's the uh, he's one of the like the lead detailer here. He's been working here for several months now. You guys haven't seen him. He's a super good dude. So uh, that was just like off a whim. <laughs> I walked into the shop and this was happening. So I just grabbed and grabbed, grabbed and uh, ran and grabbed, grabbed the camera. And uh, so that was pretty cool. I, um, you know, you can't, you can't get much better of an intro than that. So uh, if you guys saw the truck stuff, a couple of new things on there. Uh, yeah, um, I ended up picking up a, a, a new vernier caliper this one from Storm Tools. Uh, the part number on this one is 3C350. Um, this thing reads in fractions. It's kind of cool. So uh, picked it up. Mine, fuck man, I've had mine for so long. This was like a Princess Auto deal and uh screens cracked it re reads all fucking weird nowadays so uh i haven't used it in a long time so uh we do machine a lot of rotors here um i know you guys i've i've put things on there before on on like uh, instagram and stuff of machine and rotors and people are like what the fuck are you machine and rotors for i sell time S plain and simple i sell time so that's why i machine rotors saves customers money and all that stuff. Uh, I'll show you guys the new uh, the new uh, lathe actually soon. Super nice lathe, brand new uh, Hunter lathe, and it's like top of the line. So uh, one of the we were the first in the country to have this lathe, so it's pretty cool. Um, or first in BC, I can't remember. Uh, so anyway, uh, not that I'm uh, have a couple of extra minutes while I do the uh, the evac and recharge on this Kona uh, one two three four YF. You guys know what I'm talking about. The thing takes forever to do. So uh, just had to replace the compressor on it. Um, for some strange reason, I think this thing bypasses. The compressor builds up, uh, builds up pressure really quick when it's off. And then as soon as you flick it on, it just completely bypasses or something happens internally. And uh, we lose all our pressure and then our AC shuts off and doesn't come back on. So um, not a bad job to do the compressor though but uh, the, the whole, all the time is taken up with this thing. 
So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed today's snap on Wednesday um, as much as I enjoyed making it. And remember to uh, comment, like, share, subscribe. And uh, peace out, guys. I will see you in the next one. Thank you.